Hey, what's up, Internet? So today I wanted to tell you my top five 128 gigabyte images. And this is a pretty big commitment, especially with a lot of internets being capped at one terabyte per month. You know, you're downloading 128 gigs. Not only is that going to really uh, put a lot of strain on your internet, but it's going to slow things down. It's going to take a couple days to download. It's going to take a couple days to write it on the SD card. So it's a pretty big commitment. So you might be asking yourself, well, which one should I go with? And there's at least four that I know about that are pretty mainstream and fairly up to date. And I want to tell you my top three for that. And since there's four, I'll tell you, you'll see where the fourth one uh, goes. Right now we're watching an updated version of Ray's 128 gigabyte image. And that's really where it all starts out because all four of the images we're gonna be talking about today actually came from Ray's. So they all were based off that one image. They all have the, almost the exact same arcade packs. For sure you can add more to them, people have, and uh, we'll talk about that in this video. So in last place, we have Ratty Daves. Now Ratty Daves is just, there's a lot of bugs in it. It's really not that good. It's, it's kind of whack. The really thing why people really like Ratty Daves is for these bezels here. You can absolutely add these bezels to a raise image or something else. But uh, this is really, I think, what people liked about it was it had some cool little programming done to it. But other than that, it really does take fourth place. It's out of date and needed some upgrading to do. In third place, we have the Regilod 128 gigabyte image. The only reason why I'm docking this image, it's actually one of the most recent releases as far as the 128 gigabyte category. Um, it's got all that new uh, artwork you see on the right side here. It's got all the videos working really well. Um, so it's a really squared away image. The biggest downside is that it's a little large. It really doesn't fit all the 128 gigabyte SD cards out there. Rays doesn't either. Um, as well as all the images on here. Actually, I would say Ratty Daves actually wins in that category in that it's actually the smallest file out of all these images. So if you have like a non-name brand SD card, Ratty Daves might be the go-to for just for that reason. But back on this, it's a beautiful image, loved it. It was really well done. The person who created it also put files in there for your PlayStation 3 controllers and other controllers. So uh, there was really no really um, time spared on it. Like everything was thought about and put into it. And even on first boot, you can put in your controllers. You see this little arcade system we're looking at now. It, it changes the system on top of the arcade cabinet as well. So a lot of little details done on this. It's a beautiful image. And when you go into each system, it's even prettier. So, I mean, I would love to give this number one. The reason that I'm kind of docking is on that space, which is pretty important for most people, which is uh, the, the fitting on your SD card because it could be a beautiful image, but if it doesn't fit, then you don't even get to see it. So I really think that's kind of the, the, the chicken before the egg or however you want to say that stuff. Yeah. Okay. In number two, we have Mad Little Pixels 128 gigabyte unified layout. Um, again, based off of Ray's image. So all these are based off of Ray's. It does have a different theme on here. It is really gorgeous, really nice. Um, a couple different things on here is it does have uh, Daphne and it does have like three or four Dreamcast games that do work. So kudos on that. That is a big bonus. Um, this is a shrunken version. There's about three versions of this out there. There's like a one and then it was, there's a shrunken and then there's a, a, a more shrunken. I have like the, the third shrunken version that fits on a lot more 128 gigabyte SD cards. So we'll see the size of this later in the video, but um, don't get me wrong, it's beautiful. It works really well. Um, it's based on Ray, so it has very similar games and game collections. There's a lot of little things fixed on it. Um, so it's a great, great image. Um, the only reason it's not getting number one spot is it's not the original. Uh, other than that, I think it really is, uh, it's a great image. It's worth checking out. A lot of people like it because out of the box, it just works. Um, and for those reasons, it, it's, you know, it's a good contender. Worth the download. In number one, we have the original Ray's image. You can update it, and I've showed you how to update it in these videos, or you can just run it stock. It's a great image just by itself. You can see here that the video we're watching, I've been running this image before I even had a capture card. Uh, so, you know, I, I, I kind of have a sore spot in my heart for this. You know, it's kind of my, the where I've made a lot of videos initially and really got me into RetroPie and like the potential of an image and uh, you know, just how cool a track mode could be as well. This is the first track mode I had ever seen. So a lot of nostalgia um, and uh, it's a beautiful image. As you saw, all the images in this video are based off this image. So it's kind of like the vanilla ice cream in that it's the original 
was vanilla the original? I don't know, but it's you know it's kind of the the staple 128, if you will. Um, so it's a great, great, great image. You don't have to update it, but you can. There's updates how to do that. You can change the the, the styles here. It comes with PSP, PlayStation, Nintendo 64, Neo Geo. It's just a huge collection of games that all run great. And uh, it kind of started this whole movement that we've seen of, uh, you know, pre-configured images already for you. So for those reasons, it's number one. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this list. I really think all of these images deserve a, um, a shot. You know, I don't think any are be necessarily better than the rest significantly. Uh, I just gave you kind of the different reasons for each one. So uh, number, so first one was raised, even updated. It's still uh, about the same size as the original. There's the original right there. So um, this is on an external hard drive. So it's just spinning up here. Okay, so the original raised, 119, 127,865,000,000 bytes. And then we have uh, mad little pixels around here somewhere shrunk so this is, again is the smallest one at 114 gigs 123 uh billion bytes so much smaller on the shrunk one this is going to fit a lot more uh, sd cards and then we have the regilod which again is going to be huge so it goes to 119 but it's 128 all of them let's put them in order here one these are the same There we go. So from left to right and then down, you have your images here. Okay? So I hope you like this video. If you do have any questions, comment below. If you like what I do, maybe subscribe, like the video if it was helpful to you at all. A lot of people ask me, hey, you know, what about this image? What about that image? So there you go for the 128 size. Um, Check out, I'm going to do some other videos on the 64, 32, and 16 sizes as well. Those will be coming out shortly. And we'll see you guys on the next one.